George Sherman was one of my first uh, influences. I, I liked the way he played. And he was kind of like the Bill Evans of the time, you know, his harmony and his concept. Jazz was what I always wanted to play, but I didn't really start to get into it till I came down here. I had my share of gigs in New York and stuff, but uh, when I was working with Ira Sullivan at the Rancher, this was in about 1968, we'd be up to six nights a week, you know, just playing. And we'd start at 11 o'clock at night. <laughs> we'd finish about three, four in the morning. And six nights, that's a, that's a grind. But it was great. We, we uh, you know, play, just play. And uh, that's what you have to do. I love playing with Dolph because not only like the style he has on the piano and everything he adds, it's um, like everything he has to talk about, like composers and learning tunes. Like he said he knows like over a thousand tunes. I'm sure he knows over like a million tunes, but <laughs> that's possible. <laughs> It's very fun to play with someone who pushes you and compliments you at the same time. Yeah, these kids were very good. It was really they could play, and uh, they're on the way. You know, if uh, they have a great career ahead of themselves, if they want to pursue it, stay with it. My name is Drew Tucker. I'm the education director here at Arts Garage, and. Uh, our education programs are really uh, multifold and multifaceted, and the fact that we take uh, young children who are just beginning, who have a passion for music, who, uh, whose parents see the value in a musical education, and we make sure that we, uh, we're enriching them and doing our job to make sure that the future generation of music is, um, is alive and well. Kids today, I mean, when they, their training is so uh, on a professional level, that they're ready to go out and play with bands, and, and, you know, and read, be able to read and, and uh, you know, play the book, so to speak. A lot has to do with the, the empathy of the players, and uh, 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 you have very good taste, because he, could, he was competent and he wasn't in my way. Yeah, that's true. You see, that, that's, that's the thing, and the same, the same with a piano player, he can't be uh, taken over so much, you know, that the guitar player can't even get anything in there. So it's, it's a matter of give and take. You know, and if you're just, if you're comping simple enough, it'll all, it's, it'll fit, it'll fit down. Jazz, I, like I told you, it's the one constant for me. Wonderful to, to listen to, it's wonderful to play, you know, and uh, any attempts to, to to save it and to maintain it, it is good. It's good. It's, it's, it's history. It's American history. It's indigenous. I like that word. I use it because it's a big word. And I, but it's true. Jazz Archive, capturing living history now.